वेलकम बैक गाइस टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस क्वेश्चन 5.68 5.69 एंड 5.70 बिकॉज ऑफ द वेरी क्लोज रेलेवेंस बिटवीन दीज क्वेश्चंस सो व्हाट इज द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ क्वेश्चन 5.68 कंसीडर एक्सरसाइज 5.62 व्हाट इज द मीन नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स हु फेल द टेस्ट ओके सो व्हाट वाज द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ क्वेश्चन 5.62 द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट अ स्टूडेंट एट अ लोकल हाई स्कूल फेस द स्क्रीनिंग टेस्ट फॉर स्कोलियोसिस कर्वेचर ऑफ द स्पाइन इज नोन टू बी 0.0 zero four okay so this is what this is the probability of the next 1875 students at the school who are screened for scoliosis okay so the next statement of it is of no relevance for us with respect to question 5.68 so here the probability is given that is 0.04 the sample size here is 1875 which is the p and which is n and in order to find the mean number of students who fail the test here we have to use the formula which is mu equal to np for the poisson distribution okay we have n we have p we can put the values here and on the basis of it we will find the value of the mean of the number of students who fail the test okay so mu equal to np is the formula which we will use here if we don't know the value of p how can we find it out we can find out by writing the number of the samples in a set which we want to find the probability of divided by the total number of the items okay which are in the sample space okay so this is what from it we can find out p and n is what n is basically the amount in the sample we have here which is n okay so this is mu equal to np in most of the cases you will be given the value of p and n and if it is not given you can find out by the procedure which i have mentioned here in question 5.69 the probability that a person will die when he or she contracts a virus is 0.01 of the next 4000 people infected what is the mean number who will die here again n is given here this p is given by using the same formula we can find out the value so let me find them out so 4000 multiplied by 0.001 okay it would be what it would be this okay this will be here and it will be 4 okay so this is the mean number of the people who will die is 4 okay similarly uh, here in 5.6 to what was the answer it was 0.004 multiplied by 1875 and multiplying them we can find the answer of question 5.68 okay now question 5.70 a company purchases large lots of certain kind of electronic devices a method is used that rejects a lot of lot if two or more defective units are found in a random sample of 100 units so a what is the mean number of defective units found in a sample of 100 units if the lot is 1% defective here this 1% is what this is the probability and from it i can find it out by 1 by 100 this is 0.01 okay and the number of items here are n which are 100 okay so this is what n is mu is equal to np n is 100 this is 0.01 so multiplying 100 with 1 by 100 it will be 1 okay similarly the variance of it in the case of the poisson distribution mean is almost equal to the sigma square so therefore the value of the variance will remain the same okay so uh, this is the today's videos in which we have discussed the mean and variance of the poisson distribution and uh, i have told you that how to find out the mean value the cases in which the sample size or the samples are given which is n and uh, probability is given and the other cases in which the probability is not given the formula to find it out is also mentioned in this video okay so that's it for today if you have any question you can ask me in the comment box see you soon